Hello, good day. Welcome to our YouTube channel. My name is Ken. I am a university student from Samatayu Municipal College. Today, we're going to talk about our solar system. Our solar system is one of more than 500 solar systems in our Milky Way galaxy. It has an approximate size of 287.46 billion kilometers. This is roughly translated into 1.5 light years. Our solar system is one of more than 500 solar systems in our Milky Way galaxy. It has an approximate size of 287.46 billion kilometers. This is roughly translated into 1.5 light years. The Sun is the center of our solar system. Its gravity holds the solar system together. The Sun is composed of 70% hydrogen, 28% helium, and 2% of other heavier elements. There are 8 planets in our solar system. They are categorized into two classifications. The first is the terrestrial planets, and the second one are called the Jovian planets. Terrestrial planets had a rocky and solid surface. They had a few or sometimes doesn't have moons, they don't have a ring system, and they were relatively small. Mercury is the smallest planet in our solar system. It is the closest planet to the Sun. Mercury only takes 8 to 8 days to orbit around the Sun, getting its name from the sweet Roman god of shopkeepers, merchants, and medicine. Venus is the hottest planet in our solar system. The surface temperature on Venus can reach for about 471 degrees Celsius. It is nearly as big as Earth. As its name suggests, the astonishing beauty of Venus ravished the ancient and current astronomers today. Our planet, as we know, Earth, is the only planet in our solar system that is capable of nurturing life. Unlike other planets, Earth is the only one that isn't named after a Roman god. Nine, after the Roman god of war, Mars, is the home for the tallest mountain in our solar system, the Olympus Mons. The Mars surface is full of iron oxide, also known as frost, that gave its reddish color. Mars had the largest dust storms in our solar system ever recorded. Jovian planets are divided into two classifications, the gas giants, Jupiter and Saturn, which are made up mostly by helium and hydrogen. The ice giants, however, Neptune and Uranus, contain rock, ice, water, methane and ammonia. Jupiter is the largest planet in our solar system. Its immense size can actually fit 1,200 Earths inside. Its great spot is a huge storm that ranged at for at least 250 years. Saturn has more moons and rings than any other planet. Saturn is the most distant planet that we can see with the naked eye. Saturn is named after the Roman god Sternus and was known to the Greek as Cronus. Uranus is nearly the coldest planet in our solar system. Uranus has an odd moving since it's the only planet that rotates vertically. Its moon also orbits strangely around the Uranus. They also orbit vertically, acting like a giant ferris wheel. Neptune is the most distant planet from the Sun. Neptune has a very active climate. Large storms whirl through the upper atmosphere at up to 600 meters per second. Dwarf planets are celestial bodies resembling a much more smaller planet, but they are lacking a certain criteria to be considered a planet. There are at least five known dwarf planets in our solar system, namely Pluto, Ceres, Eris, Haumea, and Makemake. Asteroid Belt is a region of space between the orbits of Mars and Jupiter, where most of the asteroids in our solar system are found. Beyond the gas giant Neptune lies a region of space filled with icy bodies, known as the Kuiper Belt. This chilly expanse holds trillions of remnants of the early solar system. The Oort Cloud is a theoretical cloud proposed to surround the Sun. It is known as the edge of our solar system, where our Sun has no longer influence of gravity. Space is full of wonders. Satisfy your hunger for knowledge by subscribing to our channel.